Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, don't forget to subscribe. I post literally all the time. And my social media is always linked down below. So if you guys aren't following my Instagram, definitely follow my Instagram. I just love taking pictures and yeah, having fun with like different outfits and stuff on there. And speaking of outfits, as you can tell by the title of this video, I'm gonna be showing you so many new pieces of clothing that I got for back to school. And I use the term back to school very loosely just because you guys know especially if you've been watching me for a while, that I'm not going back to school. It feels super surreal because I graduated from BU in May that I'm just not going back in September. I feel like I am deep down. I just feel like I'm on summer break but still like a college student. So that's really weird for me. I feel like a lot of these clothes would be really good for back to school. And some of the things are a little bit more warmer because it's still summer. And especially in Boston and I know so many places, it's still really warm in September and... Um, yeah, I just feel like warmer clothes make sense. Like I just always remember being in dorms in the beginning of the school year like frying and you literally can only wear like tank tops and shorts because it's still so hot out. So without further ado, let's get on into it. Okay, I guess the first thing I'll start off with is the one pair of jeans I'm going to be showing you in this video because I feel like everybody gets jeans for back to school and I just remember growing up always getting like a new pair of jeans for school. So. These are from Madewell. Before I forget to mention, everything that I'm gonna be showing you, I'm gonna try my best to link down below. Some of the things I don't know if I'm gonna be able to find links for. This is kind of collective. I've been getting it over like the past month or so. So I'm gonna try my best, but just bear with me. And this video is not sponsored, just FYI, in case you're wondering. Everything I got, I bought, and it's just not sponsored. Okay, so. <laughs> Like I was saying, these Madewell jeans, la la la. If you guys actually saw my last video, no, it wasn't my last one. If you guys saw my channel, I just posted Boyfriend Buys My Outfits, and Max actually got these for me, but they're so perfect. I would really recommend them, and so some of those things I'm gonna be showing in here, um, just because I think they're really good for back to school. So, these are just, like I said, high-waisted Madewell jeans. They're the 10-inch high-rise skinny. Oh, and I get a tall. I'm five foot nine, so if you're maybe like five eight, five nine and above, I would just recommend the tall, or I think they even have like extra tall, so, Yes, I just love the wash of these, a good like dark wash jean. I think they're gorgeous and perfect for back to school. I'm going to say right now, a majority of this video is going to be Aritzia. I recently found Aritzia, when did I like discover it? Maybe in the spring, and my sister is like the biggest Aritzia fan and has always worn Aritzia, but I never really went in there. And then when they had their sale, I like, went ham like you're about to see i literally went ham because i feel like their stuff is so expensive but i know it's because it's such good quality like they are such a great company overall and like super sustainable da, da, da. i could get more into it but yeah so it was really great that they had a sale this summer because i got to literally buy everything and just bear with me here we are now starting Aritzia. Okay, I guess I will start with like the cooler weather clothing and then I have like a separate pile of like warmer weather clothing. I just think back to school time is very interesting because some of you might wear like a really nice romper like this back to school or like dresses and stuff. I, it just really depends like where you are, what you're trying to accomplish, like just your whole vibe. So like for me, when I was in high school, I feel like I tried so hard I would get ready like this every single day and just, I guess what people thought of me mattered so much. I don't know why I did it. And now looking back, I think it's so funny. But if you love getting all the way ready and stuff, obviously, like, you do you, girl. Um, but then in college, I think in the beginning of college, I would still get all ready and wear, like, normal, really nice clothes every day. And I remember posting outfit of the week videos, like, my freshman, sophomore year. And everyone would be like, why do you wear, like, nice clothes to college? Like, everybody at my school wears big cozy t-shirts, shorts, sweatpants, whatever. Um, and I feel like definitely by... My senior year, I was wearing like sweatpants and sweatshirts every day, which I kind of felt uncomfortable with since I was in business school and it was like all marble and like really fancy and a lot of people were wearing like even business formal some days for presentations or whatever whatever it may be. And I feel like generally at BU and the business school people dressed nicer just because I don't know, it was a business school and it was fancy, like, what does it even matter? So I kind of felt uncomfortable wearing sweatpants and sweatshirts in there some of the time, but it didn't stop me, and all I'm trying to say is, like, a lot of this is casual, but I know a lot of you dress casual, especially in college, so, yeah, okay, let's get into it. So, first couple things from Ritz, I'm going to show you guys are sweatshirts, because I literally would wear sweatshirt leggings every day, or if I wore sweatpants, maybe, like, a shirt, so I wasn't literally wearing, like, sweatshirts with pants but this is just a sweatshirt I got from Aritzia it's this beautiful like purpley 
gray color i don't even know how to describe it but i just like that it was so like neutral and it's so cozy i've worn it like a million times already and i think i got it in a medium so it would be like a little more like loose yeah and oversized is from the brand tna i think that's what a lot of this stuff is especially like the sweatshirt sweatpants i think aritzia just has a bunch of different brands but anyway this is from aritzia so cute and i actually had matching little like same exact like purpley color um spandex shorts to go with and i lost them and i'm so sad but it looked really cute i would like wear it all together it's like a little matching outfit but those are gone so that's the first sweatshirt second sweatshirt i think this is so cute okay i was just i literally looked at like the thousands of things on their sale like i looked at everything on their website and just bought everything you'll see um but this is also from tna it's a size two because some of their stuff if it's like oversized it'll be like one two three so i just got a two and this is so oversized and so cozy i just feel like a big pink marshmallow and i just love it it's like this beautiful bubblegum pink i think it's so cute and even though these were on the sale i hope that they're still like in stock so you guys can get them if you like them and i can link them for you okay then this is this beautiful light purple sweatshirt i will say from aritzia that i feel like online their stuff looks a lot more pastel than it is like this is a lot more bright in person and online i thought it was like a really light purple um so some things i got in the past it looked like this light like coral color and when i got it it was like neon coral um so i exchanged those or returned them or whatever but anyway this is just this light purple oversized sweatshirt i think it's so cute i love this detail at the top like the little like slouchy neck um this is also in a size two because it's like oversized fitting adorable oh and this one actually isn't like soft on the inside it's more of just like you guys can tell i don't know <laughs> like towel feeling <laughs> this is like more of a thin one but those other ones were like fuzzy on the inside like typical sweatshirts okay actually i'll just show you these two sweatpants i got as well so at first i ordered these white ones these are a size small i want to say these were called like the boyfriend sweatpant but again i'll have them linked down below so just go check if you're interested these are just all white sweatpants i don't think i had like a complete just all white pair of sweatpants and I thought they were really cute and I loved the way that they fit me when they came so then I actually had to order them in gray because I just love the way that they fit and I felt like I had a bunch of the gray Brandy Melba sweatpants but I feel like after a while they got really stretched out one of them literally of mine got like holes in the butt yeah I don't know I just think they're like not as good quality and would just wear out so I needed like a new gray pair of sweatpants and I love the way the white ones fit so again these are like the boyfriend sweatpants small DNA. Love them. Then from Aritzia, I got this little, this says community on it. That must be like another brand. And it's just this gray, like sweatery cape thing. I was debating on this for a while. I'm like, do I need it? But I feel like I do because like in the summer, you can just throw this on. Um, I feel like I always get chilly at night or like when you go to dinner or something, you know how your parents are always like, bring a sweater. So I feel like this is perfect. And I just think it's so cute. It goes with everything. Yeah. Oh, that reminds me. On to the next thing. Wait, wait, back up. Before I stopped talking about this, I remember when I first got it, it started shedding all over my clothes that I'd wear underneath of it, and I was like, oh my god, this is so bad. Like, I really hope that this isn't an ongoing issue because I really like it. And then I just threw it in the wash, and I think I just hung it dry because I don't think you can dry it. It would probably shrink. Um, and now it doesn't shed anymore, so... If you get that and you're wondering, just like wash it first. Okay, then this Max actually got me when boyfriend pick out my outfit type of thing. Um, but it is the cutest romper and I kept seeing it in Aritzia and I was like, Gretchen, you're not even allowed to try it on. It's so expensive. But then Max got it for me. So thank you, Max. I love you. And I just think this is so perfect. So if you dress nicer for high school, college, whatever it is, this makes more sense for you than all of the sweatpants and sweatshirts I was showing you. Um, so I think this would be a really good option. And it's adorable. You could even wear this like business casual with like a blazer and like nice loafers or something because it's like a really nice like formal material. It just goes like that. Oh, and it's long enough. Since I'm 5'9", a lot of rompers go up my butt, DMI, and are just too short on me, but this is long enough, so I love this so much and I just think it's adorable. Okay, you guys, moving on with Aritzia. I got these two dresses that I'm obsessed with but are a little bit controversial because Louisa and Max tell me that they look like nightgowns but I don't see it. I mean, I do because they're really soft, like oversized, slouchy, and just comfy but I just think they're adorable and I love them. So, 
don't really care what people think and it's just this gray like it's so stretchy come on and like so soft and like cozy feeling and like you know that material um but it's gray it has like a little v-neck it's a t-shirt dress and another reason i'm so obsessed with this is it has pockets you guys like hello so i love this so much and it just fit me so well and it was long enough and i just kept wearing it to the pool like over my bathing suit that i ordered it in pink because i thought the pink one was so cute and i feel like this would be so good for september for back to school because um it's still like well unless you think it looks like a nightgown i still think it looks nice like it's a dress but it's like cozy and loose and flowy so it's gonna keep you cool and not make you like too hot and again it has the little pockets on the side and i think the pink is so cute and i'm obsessed with them so you may or may not think it looks like a nightgown but i love them okay then i got the same tank top in three colors because i was that obsessed so the first one i got was this yellow one and i loved the cut of it it's like again stretchy and like soft but it goes kind of higher and it's cropped um but it was just so comfortable and i loved the yellow so then i went online and they had it in black and white and i ordered it in black and white i remember the white they were out of stock in a small but i got a medium and it's like totally fine i feel like at aritzia i always get smalls but then if like they're out of stock in a small i just get a medium and it fits a little bit bigger and it's no big deal so love the white one as well and then the black one you can see i didn't even wear it yet still has the tags on it all this has been sitting in a pile in my closet because i've been wanting to show you guys so then this is it in black I just love like the cut of those tank tops oh and i guess because i talked about sizing a little bit um i'm sure you guys like know what size i typically and if you like are with me frequently and watch my videos this my friend works at a ritzy and she said runs small um and max got me in a us four and i think it's actually good at first i thought it was too small if you can see it like fits my waist kind of perfectly um it could be i guess a little bit more looser I don't know what do you guys think should it be like looser or is it okay kind of more form-fitting i don't really know so i hope that helps um okay then i got this white big like oversized t-shirt and when i mean oversized i mean really oversized i did not realize how big it was going to be until it came i ordered it in a size small and it looked like just like a loose fitting white t-shirt on the model and it is massive like this would be a boys like xl i feel like it's so big um and i debated returning it but then i was like you know what also the sleeves are like long which i thought was kind of weird but i roll them up and i cuff them and it looks really cute and i love wearing it really oversized like it basically covers my whole butt with um little spandex shorts and i traveled to and from the outer banks in this with those purple spandex shorts that are now gone and just lost um but it was like the best travel outfit and i love that this is so cozy and just like for errands and yeah i really like that look too with like the big white oversized and the little spandex so i do like that shirt and i kept it and max can even wear it because it like fits him so he's like let's keep it <laughs> he tried it on okay then i got these little gray shorts obviously you're not wearing these to school but during the school year i know you sleep every night and i just thought these would be cozy little like sleeping shorts so that is literally the only reason i wore them i would never wear these out in public they're like gray booty shorts but um yeah i just thought they were cozy and cute so hope that was helpful if you want little pj shorts if not maybe this is for you <laughs> okay then i got i literally went crazy at aritzia this is so wild that we're still on aritzia I got this gray top that I kept seeing on the model online and I thought it was so gorgeous with like the little cutout right here. It's their thick like ribbed material that's so stretchy and so comfortable and just like the best quality. Um, I have two cropped little tank tops I feel like in this material like a white one and a black one and I wear them constantly and they're so nice because they're so structured and thick that you don't even need like a bra with them. So I love this gray one and then I saw it in store but in black so I was like okay I need it like come on how cute and they're just so cute on so I got those all right are we finally nearing the end of it <laughs> okay then I got this black dress which I love you guys have also probably seen like all of this all over my Instagram already but like I said I've been getting it over the past month I wore this the day I got my new like Tom Ford sunglasses oh I could show those in here but I guess sunglasses aren't really like back to school anyway um yeah i just really like this black like stretchy again soft but like thick like knit dress from aritzia and 
I feel like I have a lot of black, more fancy dresses, like cocktail dresses, but this is like a day, like during the day, like casual type of dress, I feel like. So I feel like you could wear this to school if you wanted to. It might be like a little bit much, but you know what I mean. I would so wear that to school with um, like that gray KB cardigan thing. All right, then the last two things I got at Aritzia are these crop tank tops. I remember really pushing the envelope. You know what? In high school, I would wear like crop things with like booty shorts and get sent home or have to change or whatever. I remember we had a rule in high school where like the bottom of your fingertip, that's like how long your shorts had to be. So like, I guess this would almost work. Like I said, this is long enough. But yeah, I would like get in trouble all the time. And I think your tank top had to be at least two fingers. So. This might pass the test for you guys with like dress codes. These would not, but I mean, I guess if you wear like a little jacket over it and like high enough pants, I don't know. But it's just this white little cropped tank top. And the reason I got this is because Lucy had it and I was stealing it because it's like this thick, nice material with like stretchy straps that I love and I just thought it was adorable. So got that in white and then I also got it in black. Yay! This feels so funny to be doing a back to school haul when I'm not going back to school, but I know so many of you watching are. And like my cousin Mandy literally left yesterday to go, to go back to University of South Carolina. So I just can't believe that school is like starting so soon. And I was texting you guys know Danielle Carolyn on YouTube. Um, and it's just so crazy. I was like watching her videos and her stories and stuff and she's like about to go back to school. Like I can't believe that summer is almost over and it's gone by so quick. I mean, it's still the beginning of August, but like the fact that people go back to school already is nuts. Like I was always lucky at BU that school started kind of like beginning of September. So I guess later than a lot of colleges. Anyway, moving on, I'm gonna show you these shorts that I think are life changing <laughs> from Lululemon. I love them so much. And I have them in this print right here this white like gray stripey print and I was so obsessed with them they're the on the fly shorts that if you guys saw my vlog where I went on like a wild rampage and like had to find them in black because I love them so much I finally found them on Poshmark um, and the difference between these and their woven material to me is that the woven ones feel a little bit more like scratchy and like not as stretchy and these are so soft and stretchy and just amazing so i'm so happy i found them poshmark because they're like all sold out online and in stores so these are them they're amazing and i love them and yeah i know a lot of you wear t-shirts and shorts to school so i would really recommend these shorts for that and hopefully they have other colors because i think the black is still out of stock or you can just go hunting for them like I did. Um, all right, then I'll show you guys the stuff that I'm gonna show you that Max actually got me, but I feel like it's good for back to school. Um, this, again, would be like a more cozy pant for back to school, and this is the same material as those shorts, but these are the on-the-fly pants, 7 8 pants. And the shorts, if you're wondering, I get a size four, but then the pants, I go up to a six. Um, any like loose fitting pants from Lulu, I'll always get a six just because I want them to be looser and typically I'm a four. So these are them, love them so much. So soft, so stretchy, amazing, super comfortable if you wanna be in that comfy vibe for back to school. Also in the comfy vibe for back to school, I have two things to show you from Brandy Malville, and these are just these black, like, what is this called? Waffle knit shorts, um, and really, really comfortable, like almost like pajama looking, but again, if you want to be comfortable in school, I would recommend these. And Lucy had these, and I feel like they always look so comfortable, and I really wanted them, so got those. And then just a white, basic, little crop tank top ribbed. I feel like you can never have too many basics, so that's what that is. And then also, this isn't good for school, but I'm just going to show you because I think it's really cute and really unique. It's this little, like, actually not white, cream urban crop top, and I know it looks like literally a bra or a bralette. You could probably wear it as a bralette, um, but I would probably wear it as a crop top, like, going out. I know if you're in college, a lot of you go out, and I know you're all 21, and <laughs> um, yeah, so if you go out, I mean, I feel like this would be good for that with like really high-waisted jeans or high-waisted shorts, skirts, such such as that. But um, if you're in high school, I mean, probably not. But I think it's really cute or if you like want to wear it on the weekend. So, yes, 
this is from Urban and I really want to find a link for you guys so I can link it down below because I what I didn't realize and what I feel like you can't realize from holding it up is the straps are like really far out but I feel like it's a really unique look and something I haven't seen so I really like that then I'm going to show you shoes that I got so I ordered these black sneakers which I feel like are so perfect I feel like for back to school I would always get a new pair of like shoes and then jeans so yeah I feel like these would be really good if you wear sneakers to class a lot um, I know in college I feel like I would wear leggings, sneakers, sweatshirt like every day, like I keep saying. And these are just the black Adidas Ultra Boost. I love them so much. I've had them in white for like years and they were turning gray because I wear them like every day and they were getting so dirty. So I was like, I should order the black ones. I love the white ones so much. They're amazing. I want to say that they run a half size big because I'm typically always an eight and a half and in my ultra boost I both of them are eights so I would just recommend going half size down but I love these so much and I actually remember my white ones were like $180 which is so wild and these were on sale for 90 I don't know if it was just like a one-time thing on Adidas that these were like half off but if they're still half off I would definitely recommend buying them and buying them now before they're gone so hopefully they're still on their website on sale and you guys can grab them too if you like them all right then these are so wild and i'm so obsessed with them if you couldn't tell these are custom nike air force ones and i've actually never had air force ones before um but like mandy lucy like everyone and their mother all of you probably have them and i'm just like really late to hop on the bandwagon i guess and basically these are custom ones at the 112 because if you couldn't tell they have this beautiful dior print right here and this matches my dior like really big toe i don't even know what the style is called um they match them perfectly it's like the same exact material and if you didn't know 112 which i think is so cool i was like stalking their instagram stories they use like real bags like old like vintage um real designer bags from the designer so this isn't just like a print that looks like the dior print like it's actually made from a dior bag that they cut up which honestly gives me anxiety that they're like cutting up these beautiful designer bags but it's allowed me to have these wonderful shoes so i think they're so awesome and i can't wait to wear them with my bag and they're gonna match and i love these um and i know that's like really extra of me but i know that you can also just get plain air force ones i'll link those down below too because i feel like those are really good for back to school and like everybody and their mother has them the last couple things i'm going to show you are very much not back to school but let me explain myself it's all bikinis um and the reason i have those is well because it's still summer but also i'm going to show you them because in college especially if it's summer warm like mandy at university of south carolina has so many bikinis because it stays warm forever there and she's always like going to the pool and stuff so i feel like that's very applicable if you're in college somewhere warm um but even at bu like we would go to the beach in september because it's so warm and yeah if you're in high school Maybe you can still wear them if it's still warm where you live. Okay, I'm gonna show you all these bikinis. They're all from Frankie's, which I know is wild, but I've had a couple from Frankie's in the past. Like I have this old red one and stuff, and they're so nice. And they've always been so expensive, but this summer I was like, you know what? I just really want nice bikinis that I feel really comfortable in and that are really like soft and good quality and will last me like forever instead of just always getting like cheap ones that I've always had. So yes, I kind of went crazy. I'm gonna show you in the order. That i got them so first i ordered just these two and if you guys remember when i was in cape cod i showed you these this was actually on sale which was so nice and i think it's still on there so would recommend i love it it's like this really soft material that all my frankie's bikinis used to be and then now i feel like they have this new rib material that like all these other ones are um and it has this pretty like crochet at the top and then just the matching bottoms to go with what is on these there's like dirt on the back of that. Okay, <laughs> then I got this beautiful yellow one, which again, kind of like Aritzia. If you can see all of these colors are like neon, very bright, like in your face. And online they look pastel. So I thought I was getting like a light yellow bikini. Not light yellow, very, very bright, like highlighter, but I still love it. And I remember that this was called the Willa Top. And it just has that like um, soft, like ribbed material that all of these are so i love that and then i got yellow bottoms the willow bottoms were 
out of stock or only have like a large or something i feel like frankie's is hard because a lot of them will be like sold out or not have your size or something so you just kind of have to improvise the sizing i feel like is so tough and i would say typically frankie's runs small because um like that green one i have in a small and it's fine but then like this black top i'll show you is a small and it's like way too tight so now i typically just get medium like in everything i feel like bottoms especially is good for me to get a medium top i can usually get away in a get away with it being a small like I think that yellow top was a small also but then this black one is way too small so these bottoms are medium I remember these are called the boots bottoms and these are definitely my favorite style of bottoms as you will see so this black one like I was just saying boots bottom size medium perfect love them like cheeky little bottoms but not too tight because I'd get in a medium. This I got in a small, which I should have realized Mandy's smaller than me and I wanted this because she had it and she was like, yeah, mine's a small, it would fit you, like get a small. So I got a small and it is just so small on me. Like if you can tell, this thing is so tiny. So I was like contemplating keeping it or not, but then they didn't have a medium, so whatever, too late. I'm keeping it and I still like it even though it's freaking tight on me. Then I got this blue one, same boots, bottoms, medium, little blue, and then this beautiful blue top, which I think is a small, but it fits like better than that black one, so. Then the last Frankie's bikini that I have to show you is this neon orange one, which this one I really thought was like a light orange, like it really looked light on the website, um, but yeah, it's not. So this, see like this is a small and I wouldn't have gotten a medium because around it almost feels too loose like it kind of moves around um so i just feel like their sizing is kind of weird but this i love and it's like this tiny little one i posted my instagram in it and then the only they didn't have the boots bottoms in this orange so then i got these bottoms which are like a lot more full coverage if you are into that then i would recommend these the only thing about these ones that i would notice is that a lot of times when you wear them if you can see like the inside lining you'll kind of like see in the front which i don't like but it always like rolls over so those are all the bikinis i think this is almost it but there's something sitting over there that i feel like doesn't really belong in this video but i kind of want to just talk about them again because i'm so excited about them i'm going to show them stay right there you guys like are you kidding me <laughs> These, if you saw my vlog, you already know, I loved these for so long and I would always see them like on Instagram, like on girls and I thought they were so adorable. There's, the, there are these obviously Christian Dior little sandal mules. But then when I went to go buy them, they were like out of stock everywhere. It was the big, big shebang. And if you watch my vlog, you know that I finally was able to get them from this like one sacks that had them in florida in palm beach and they shipped them to me so thank you Saks, for having like the best customer service ever and dealing with me being high maintenance and like really wanting them even though they're like sold out everywhere so i love these so much i think they're perfect and if you're really into like designer things maybe this would be good for you or if you really just like the way they look i just love the way they look i think they're like really nice but also comfortable sandals and i love like the design and the print of them i think they're so freaking cute so i love these i definitely don't think i can link them down below or it'll just be a link to the sandals being sold out because they typically are but if you're like me you can probably call up Saks and find someone that will be really nice that you can like text and bother all the time and try to find them <laughs> so that's what i did i love those so much they're honestly not as expensive as you would think they would be and i know i will like keep them forever so that like made a lot of sense for me and they would be like super comfy to wear to school i don't know if i would like stroll up to class in them um <laughs> but I just really like them, so I wanted to talk about them again. And I think that is everything I have to show you guys. I know I got a lot, and I hope some of this was helpful, and if you wear like comfy stuff to school, hopefully a lot of that Aritzia stuff was good, and hopefully some of it's still on sale. I think this sale is still going on. It's been going on for so long. But yeah, again, everything will be linked down below. Don't forget to follow me on my Instagram, subscribe if you're not already, and thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.